So uh, I have been the technical manager for the Swarm Monitor project. It has been uh, three years of research. Uh, it's research for SMEs, so it was uh, promoting research for the benefit of European SMEs. And uh, we had three main goals. We wanted to develop a tool that allows the beekeeper to know about uh, the status of his colony without having to open uh, the hive. We wanted to uh, send an alarm to the beekeeper in case his uh, honeybees intended to swarm. And uh, we also wanted to send an alarm to the beekeeper on his mobile phone or on his email in case uh, his intervention was needed. So in case he needed to open the hive and do something uh, required because of the status of the colony. So uh, the main uh, achievements of the project is that we've managed to uh, measure uh, the vibrations that uh, honeybees uh, make in an automated fashion on uh, three different apiaries, one in France, in Avignon, one in Belgium, in Louvain, and uh, one in England, in the UK. So we managed to set up these with automatic logging of the vibration. We managed to capture uh, primary swarms on multiple instances, secondary swarms and tertiary swarms, and we managed to collect data from colonies exhibiting a range of different health disorders, colonies which did very well, some that had mild uh, health disorders, and some that uh, did so badly that they eventually failed. So we went all the way to colony failure. We managed to monitor this and we managed to correlate the vibrational signal with uh, the hive uh, status. We have come up with a way to monitor the brood cycle in uh, the f a specific frame of the colony. We have managed to detect uh, a signature indicative of uh, uh, the deterioration of the colony in the winter towards a failure. We think we can predict the failure in the winter two weeks before it takes place. And we also have developed uh, uh, the extraction of a signature from the vibrational signal, which is indicative of the preparation of the colony for swarming.